Hey everyone, I'm Chris. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I realized that I haven't made a minimalism video in a while and that's because I've been processing a lot of my travel videos. So if you're into travel like me, please check it out. I'm gonna link it down below. But I also know that a lot of my subscribers like minimalism videos. So I'm gonna show you today my minimalist bag collection. So a little history about my bags. I've um, if you've seen some of my old videos, you would know that in 2016 I decided for myself that I wouldn't buy any clothes, shoes, bags, so no shopping at all in 2016. And the last bag I bought, I think, was in 2015 when I went to Florida and I thought I needed an adult bag. So, okay, I'm just gonna quit talking right now and I'll just show you my bags. Okay, so the first bag I'm gonna show you is my work bag. This is it. It's big enough to fit my lunch box, which is perfect for me because I try to bring lunch to work every day because that just saves me a lot of money. So this bag, my mom gave this to me. This is a hand-me-down from my mom. So I hope it's still got a lot, lot of life left in it because I really enjoy this bag. Okay, next bag. By the way, I do apologize for my voice. I have a cough and cold at the moment so just bear with me so the next bag I'm gonna show you is this small crossbody bag so it looks like this by the way a lot of my bags are crossbody because that's just how I like them so this um, I bought it really cheap it doesn't have a brand I got this from JJ's maybe around 10 to 15 dollars this is my go-to bag it's small enough that it fits all my essentials phone wallet keys that's what I usually leave the home with and the occasional lip gloss so this size is just perfect it might be small for some people but this is the perfect size for me so the next bag I'm gonna show you is this nude colored bag so surprise surprise so it's still um, got a long a long um, strap it's got a long um, gold strap which is really nice detail and I don't actually I don't use this bag um, I, use, I don't use this bag a lot but I think it's because I don't have the occasion for it but um, it's a nice bag to use for maybe something smart casual so that's it it's it's a nice bag to have okay next bag another black bag because that's how I like them so most of my bags are either black or nudes and um, that's because that's how I like them because I can wear them with anything so this is another crossbody bag this is a popular brand in the Philippines it's a gerbo bag and this wasn't expensive it was like 50 off I bought it for maybe um, $50 which is really good so uh, I like this bag because um, I can put um, food container in it so whenever I eat out with my family or with my friends most of the time I will have leftovers so I bring my own food container so that I don't have to um, ask for a disposable plastic container from the restaurant so this is this bag is perfect for that okay so next bag this is my this is my Michael Kors bag. So this is my adult bag that I was talking about and it's um, It's got a long strap another crossbody bag and it fits um, a lot of It fits a lot of things in it. I, I still got like mints in this bag so back to the bag um like I said, this is my adult bag, so if I'm going to, um, somewhere like a work, um, like a work function, like a work um, study day or work seminar, I would use this bag. Um, if I want people to take me seriously, I would use this bag. Or if I want people to think that I'm an adult, this is the bag to use. <laughs> okay. 
So next bag. This is a 9 West bag. I don't know how much it costs because this was a um, present from my sister. So I got this in the Christmas 20... Christmas 2015 so it's really nice it's a really nice Christmas present so it's got um, a lot of compartments if you can see it so this is my second go-to bag because I feel like I abuse this bag so much so whenever I feel like um, I've been overusing this bag I would grab this bag instead so this is my second go-to bag Okay, next bag. Last but not the least. This is my only formal bag and it's got, like I said, all my bags have straps. So th this is a small bag. It's a formal black bag. I used to have two but my sister asked for the other one and so I just gave it to her because I have another one anyway. That, that other one was bigger. So this bag, it fits only like my cell phone. It won't have space for a wallet, cell phone keys, and driver's license and cards. That's all it, that's all it fits. But um, it's still okay because when you go somewhere formal, you don't really want to bring a lot of a lot of stuff with you. So this is my one and only formal bag. So okay, so those are all the bags I have. I have seven with me at the moment and some people might say that I have a lot of bags and I have to admit I have more bags than I have definitely more bags than I need and if we're gonna move sometime in the future I could easily pick out maybe two or three and I'll sell the rest or give it away and but at the meantime we're staying put and I'm lucky that I get to enjoy these and have this space for it so, so I'm keeping them and yes so hopefully you enjoyed this video thanks for watching and thanks for um, being here until the very end and let me know in the comments below how many bags you own let me know what you think about my bags and that's all I have to say for now I'll see you next time bye